All right, Shalom, Shalom, where the real Hebrew Israelites come day in and day out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon the Great, which is America. First off and foremost, all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Kadash. Double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone and salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. It's the brother Shapatya coming at you again with a quick lesson through the Spirit. Um, today's lesson is Titus, the third chapter, and let's just see where the Spirit takes us. Titus 3 and 1. Put them in mind to be subject to principalities and powers, to obey magistrates, and to be ready, I mean, to be ready to every good work. All right? So it says, put in, in mind to be subject to principalities and powers and obey magistrates. Now check this out. Let's get this blue letter real quick. Let's go into some of these words. All right. Principalities, beginning, origins, persons, person or thing that commerces, first person, all right, leader, all right, powers, all right. This is really that powers, rule of government, like you see what I'm seeing right here, authority over, you know, so on and so forth. All right. Because some of the definitions won't be right. You have to, through the spirit, you can find the right definition because sometimes they'll give you three or four. But in this, talking about, in this context, principalities, leaders, all right, um, powers, all right. And then it says magistrates, obey ruler or superior. All right. Now, and it says to every good work. All right. Because one angle, hey, we have principalities, powers and magistrates within this truth on the right hand side. So we obey them. And we, we're ready to do every good work. All right. Now, on the other side. All right. Because even, even going back into history, you had certain Israelites that had Israelite servants, all right? So you had to obey them, and it was a certain way you went and, and carried yourself. But even in this world, we got to go to work for the so-called white man and all this. It's a, it's a certain way you got to handle yourself, man, all right? Because we all know what Romans 13 says. We, hey, we can't, what's that, 13? We can't go against uh, the powers that be, Okay? It says, verse two, to speak evil of no man, to be uh, to be no brawlers, but gentle, showing all meekness unto all men. Hey, if it's possible, be at peace with all men. All right, there's a certain uh, etiquette you have to carry about yourself. Okay, you got to have certain manners. All right, verse three, for we ourselves also <laughs> were sometimes foolish. Did, listen. This is Paul speaking. He's telling you, listen, we in the flesh. Hey, we was foolish sometimes, fucked up. And the elders, hey, they always say shit. Back in the younger days, they was always beating somebody. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, you grow from that because ultimately it's about the scriptures and the spirit. And we want to be, hey, we want to be those men. All right. And those men are going to act the part regardless. So we, hey, we just fall in right in line. Um, for we ourselves, also were sometimes foolish, disobedient, deceived, serving diverse lusts and pleasures, living in malice, envy, hateful, and hating one another. Hey, shit, that's how I was when I was not in the truth. I was a nigga. I was an ally. I robbed from my best fucking friend and help him look for whatever I just fucking stole from his ass. <laughs> I was a fucking nigga, man. All right. If I, if I stole the nigga weed, I'll help him look for the weed. Like, damn. And then fucking roll up. Like, well, shit, I got my bud. I'll make you feel better. <laughs> you know, just being a nigga. <laughs> I'm glad y'all about shit, man. I got me out of that shit, man. All right. It says, but after that, the kindness and love of our power and savior towards men appear. Not by works of righteousness, which we have done, but according to, to 
tool. Let me read that again. But after that, the kindness and love of our power, our Savior, towards men appeared. All right? Not by works of righteousness, which we have done, but according to his mercy, he saved us by the washing of the regeneration and renewing of the Holy Ghost, which that's what happened, man. We became new creatures. We became new men, all right? Through that, that Holy Spirit, that comforter, the truth, Yahweh Shai, which he shared for us abundantly. There it go, through Yahweh Shai, Adon, uh, Mashiach, our Savior. Okay? And it was the mercy of the Lord, not because we out here doing good works and this and that. that, that, that yeah, hey, you know what? Well, faith and works go together, but it's ultimately about the mercy of the Lord. Who did he pre-select or predestinate for the elect? That was the mercy right there. Listen, that's why we pray and hope because we ain't going to know to the end, but we pray and hope that we're part of the elect. I don't want nothing less. Yahweh Ratazah, we're those men. Yahweh Ratazah, taking out the Holy Spirit away from us. Okay. Verse seven, that being justified by his grace, we should be made heirs according to the hope of eternal life. This is a faithful saying. These things uh, I will that thou affirm constantly that they which have believed in the power might be careful to maintain good works. Careful. Hopefully, hey, the hopefully elect. He hey, says, do nothing without advice. Do nothing without counsel. All right. It says a wise man would consider. All right. To make sure he ain't going off. But a, a sinful man, and I'm roughly paraphrasing that one. A sinful man, he ain't going to give a fuck. All right. These things are good and profitable unto men, but avoid foolish questions. Oh, right. Oh, right. Mm, fuck you, nigga. And genealogies and contentions, which a lot of you niggas are part of the circumcision like to go into. And strivings about the law, for they are unprofitable in vain. A man that is a, a heretic after first and second abomination. Uh, um, what's that? Yeah, ammunition reject. So, hey, if you talk to you one time, you don't get it cool. You come back the second time, you're still trying to get it cool. Hey, the hell with this nigga, man. Especially on repeated topics, man. That's why I says avoid foolish questions and contentions, man. And strivings about the law. You, you guys could swallow a camel but strain at a gnat. Niggas. Verse 11. Knowing that he that is such is subverted and sinneth, being condemned of himself. <laughs> the nigga already gone. He's already condemned because he don't believe. All right? Verse 12. Then I shall send Artemis uh, unto thee, or Tysias, be diligent to come unto me to uh, Nicopolis. What is that? Nicopolis. Yeah, Nicopolis, for I have determined there, uh, it's like it, for I have determined there to winter, bring Zenos, the lawyer, and Apollos on their journey diligently, that nothing be wanting unto them. Now, you know what's crazy? All these are Greek names, but all these men were men of Yahweh Shem Shai. They were in the truth, all right? And let us learn to maintain good works for necessary uses, that they be not unfruitful. All they, I mean, so like you, all that are with me, salute thee, greet them, that love us in faith, grace be with all you, amen. All right, now it's the final benediction, which, hey, you hear at the end of the videos, hey, peace, love from brothers here in Chicago, peace, love brothers from uh, LA, Louisiana, New York, hey, that's how we greet each other, man. All right, and we 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 exalt exalt or exhort all the brothers to keep on fighting and to push hard to stay in this faith, rock solid, man. All right, uh, that's a brotherhood for you, man. All right, this man, I'm gonna tell you this this is one of the realest things I have ever been involved in. It is the realest thing I've ever been involved in. All right, and I don't say that lightly, man, because 
Like the scripture says, they should know you, my disciples, by the love you show one another. And great love is shown him, man. Great love. Really think about that. Great love is shown here within GMS. And with hey, within all the brothers that have this doctrine, great love is shown. So with that, hey, meditate on these three chapters I just read, man. I know I am right now as I'm reading it. You know? With that, I'm going to say all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Karkadash. Double honors to the old apostles, a great millstone, salutations to the elect, wherever you may be, a Bible ball.